Hey everyone, Tr Tutorials here. Welcome to the first video. So today, I will be showing you how to make a custom menu on this game. That's right, welcome to Vlogsburg. Um, just thought for the first tutorial it should be a Roblox one, because it seems more popular in Minecraft nowadays. Anyway, if you enjoy this video, make sure to press that like button, and make sure to subscribe as well. I need the subscribers because it is my first video. Anyway, so today, what I'm going to be showing you is how to make a custom menu. For like, if you have like a little cafe on Bloxburg, you want to have like a custom menu so that they can see what you want. So there are a couple ways you can do it. The, there are the easy way, the better way, and the amazing way. <laughs> Actually, there's only two. But the easy way and the better way. I call them. So today, I will be going over how to do each of them. Anyway, so the one we will be doing right now, first is the easy one. I've got my little cafe over here with the Trex Cafe menu. My name is Trekky722 over here. So I have Trex Cafe menu. And I've just got a ton of things listed with their prices. And yeah so this this right here is the better and harder way if you if you want the easier way you can just search here and search menu and just choose one of these like welcome in cafe and then it lists some things that's just you know the first one that came up or you can browse through the menus and find one that you like yeah and now that you've seen the easier way, I will show you the harder way and my favorite way. What you're going to want to do is go to Google Slides or a Photoshop thing. It's whatever you want to make it on. I prefer, I personally prefer Google Slides. You'll open a new one for the sake of time. I already have one ready. And what you do is you just take text boxes, write things down, and you can highlight it and change the font and size. So I have mine really big. I'm going to make it like 60, make it nice and centered on the page. is another reason I like slides. You, it just auto centers, kind of. Put it there, and then I can change the font to whatever I want. I'm going to make it could be, because I like that. And then I'm going to start listing what I want to have on my menu. Like maybe mac and cheese. For two dollars. Right? And for the sake of time again, I already have the slide. I just copy and pasted that because I already had it here. So yeah, this is mine. And you can insert pictures if you just, you know, you can upload from your computer. Um, for the sake of my privacy, I'm not going to show you that. Um, you can use a camera and take a picture of yourself, I guess. But Roblox will actually not allow that. I actually accidentally uploaded a picture of myself to it. And it just they were mad at me and my account was actually like deactivated and I had to go through a huge process of reactivating. It was miserable. Anyway, you can go through Google Drive or Google Photos or you can just search the web. You can just search like a Roblox logo and insert that and have that as a little like Roblox Cafe or Welcome to Bloxburg logo. That did not work. <laughs> yeah, so once you have this, what you're going to want to do is hit File, then you're going to want to hit Download as a PNG. It should download, see? Then you're, you're going to want to go here. You're going to want to go to Inventory. You're going to go to decals, then get more. Then you're going to want to go to my creations, go to decals again. Oh, 
here. Find your image. Call it what you want to call it. And hit upload. For the sake of my own sanity, I'm not going to upload it because I've already got it uploaded, what, four times, as you can see. Uh, yeah, my menu went through many stages. Okay, so once you do it, you go, it should have uploaded, you go here, then you see these numbers right next to library and my in name. You copy, control C, and then you can enter Bloxburg and then you insert it. I'll show you how to insert it now if it'll let me join Bloxburg. Okay, sorry, I think my audio cut out there for a second. Anyway, once you're in, you're gonna wanna go to the, you're gonna wanna place a menu first. Then what you're gonna do is go to enter image ID, paste, control V, and hit add. And there you go. You have got yourself a menu. And now, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to have a wonderful rest of your day. And make sure to like and subscribe. Bye-bye.